Hi there, Lou's Workshop friends. I wanted to show you some of the pattern works I did. Um, here's my notes. Um, I kind of went crazy with the patterns. I took some cardboard um, packaging and I just recycled it from the recycle bin. I tore the cardboard in half and I got some thinner sheets. Um, but I also got some thick sheets that I probably can't use in the on the canvases. And so these were inspired from Lou's. See, this was a uh, a stoli <laughs> box. <laughs> Here's some more patterns. This was acrylic with some um, Sharpie markers and metallic paints. I did some swirls. That was kind of fun. And there you go. Just basic patterns. <laughs> Ginger beer box I split in half. Um, just recycling materials. I, I'm probably going to tear these little boxes apart. Mm. Not sure how many of these I will use. This one's a little too thick. I need to split it. Um, it's just too thick for a canvas, but I like the 24 karat gold that I rolled on these with the magic roller. There's some patterns I did. I was playing with last night. These were acrylic markers and uh, paint markers and regular. I haven't done anything on that yet. You can tell this was a box. You can see the backside. And you can see the cans, the rings here. I haven't I haven't painted any patterns on that. This one I started to play with, um, and this purpley blue is a color shift paint. Um, this was <laughs> this came from the Navigators. It was some junk mail I got from a charity I gave to, so I started to do little fish patterns. I don't know if Luce will ever do the ocean themed um, workshop. Maybe I'll be able to use this for that. Here's some flowers I did with paint and a brush. And these are really pretty blues with contrasting colors. And then I'm not quite done with that. This was um, a white acrylic paint I did on here with some ascriptic writing. Uh, something new I've been playing with and I overlaid two, um, two colors here. This was inspired by a sunflower, but now it kind of looks like a COVID virus. <laughs> some flowers. And so I don't know what else. that was a piece of paper. A piece of, I don't know, piece of paper. Yeah. This was a uh, um, thick paper. I don't know if I'll be able to put that on canvas or not. I haven't done any patterns on this yet. These are just background bases I did. Metallic paint. This was a Christmas card that I got sent in the mail from a charity. Um, and I just wasn't, I don't send out Christmas cards anymore, but I thought I'd recycle the paper. Recycle paper. There's another Christmas card I painted on the back of. Need to do some pattern work. This was another charity that sent a crossword puzzle book and I painted on the back of the pages with. And some patterns and bases I did. So you can kind of see the crossword puzzle showing through, but that's okay. This, um, a coffee bag. I loved the pattern work in this this new seasonal coffee from Starbucks. So I'm gonna steal some of those patterns for inspiration. Um, more of, there was some sheet music I painted over that my husband had. He's a musician, so those were some hymns that he copied. And you can kind of see so. Um, this was a stencil I rolled with some acrylic paint. This was some old acrylic paint that was kind of thick and it wasn't good for other painting, but I thought it would be good for rolling over a base that I did. This is a stencil girl. Um, I love her stencils. They're beautiful. So I used a brayer roller on that. I'm also, um, I had some gauze that I stained with tea. This was the tea I used. I'm probably going to break apart this box. Um, so I'll, I'll use that. And these are some of the markers I used. These were really nice. I recommend these markers. They're, they come out really nice. And that's it. And I used some of this mixed media paper, but it was kind of thick. So I don't know if I'll be able to use it on the canvas. So that's all I have. So thanks for watching.